All right, so today we got a bunch of cucumbers, so we need to make some pickles. We like the icebox pickles. Um, my wife's gonna be kind of telling me step by step what to do in the background, because I'm an idiot and I don't know how to make pickles. And uh, she refuses to be on the camera. <laughs> so uh, we're gonna start out. We got our jars. Uh, these are sterilized. They're already been washed. We've got our garlic in there. Uh, we can go ahead and add our onions at the bottom as well. I guess we'll kind of break these up a little bit. Don't have to, apparently, okay? Uh, <laughs> what's that? I'm not a big onion guy, but uh, my wife likes them, and everybody else seems to like them, so I'll just uh, add a good amount to each one. That's a lot of onion. All right. Add more? All of it? Mm-hmm. So this will be the idiot's guide to pickles. All of them? Yes. Oh my god, that's a lot, that's a lot of onions. I got another jar right here. Where? Oh crap. Alright. My hands are gonna smell like onions and garlic for a week after this. Alright, so we got that. Now we got our dill. We'll add those in the bottom. I'm going to show you all of it. That's where I go. Glad that in there? No. <laughs> Some of them. How's that look? Looks good? Cool. You can talk. It's okay. All right. So now we'll start stuffing our cucumbers in here. Uh, she already cut up a bunch of them for me. We'll do some cylindrical and we'll cut them to fit, make them fit in here. And then uh, whatever won't fit, we'll cut them up and we'll put them in these small mouth mason jars. So we'll start out with these cylindrical ones. Slivers? What do you call them? Spears? Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're just going to stuff as many in here. As we can, right? Just stuff it full. Jam packed. Speaking of jam packed, look at my action pants. He's cool as a cucumber. Cool, cool as a cucumber today. <laughs> His action pants. You know, I got some weird looks at Home Depot. Uh, some weird looks. So we're gonna go through and we'll, we'll we'll stuff all these cucumbers and stuff all these jars full of cucumbers, and then we'll come back. All right, so now we need four cups of water for the brine. Get a shot of these shorts. Oh my goodness. Mm, 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 mm. How Look, you doing? Look in so free, touching's gonna cost me. Right, got four cups of water. About. All right. Okay, move it over here. They're bossy. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, what is it? A quarter cup of pickling salt. So now we got a quarter cup of pickling salt to go with our four cups of water to make our brine. So we're going to add that in there. All right, we're done with that. Now we're gonna whisk it. Oh, can't forget. We got, what is this? Half a cup? Half a cup of white wine vinegar. Distilled vinegar. Distilled vinegar, there we go. Booyah. All right, now we're gonna whisk it all together. Until all the crystals are dissolved. Yep, until it's fully dissolved. Wanna get a close-up of this, man? Get a close-up of me whisking? Whisk it, baby. Oh, whisk it, baby. Whiskey, right? It, it dissolves pretty quick. It's a little harder than that. Well, I don't want to make a mess. Mm. 
And that's pretty well dissolved. All right, and before you uh, start your, your brine, go ahead and get your can lids boiling. That way you can get them put on as soon as everything's set. So uh, now we've got our, our brine going. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and add it to the jars and I can use, use one of these little canning lids or funnels, canning funnels. Mm -hmm. I just want to cover the cucumbers all the way. there stop recording all right we always make more than enough uh so we always have extra we just you can just keep it in a jar in the fridge and uh next time you just want to make, make a quick batch of pickles if you just got like two or three jars you want to make you already got the brine ready to go and it stays pretty good in the fridge for quite a long time so we always keep some in the fridge um, but we'll go ahead and get the lids on and get these canned all right so wait, wait, wait. we got the lids hot off hot off the stove Look at that. Okay. I'll put it on. You're gonna make sure you have one of these magnet things or you'll burn the skin right off your freaking finger. Um, I learned my lesson with that on the learned my lesson with that on the zucchini bread video. And uh, we'll go ahead and get all these uh, enclosed up. Uh, my wife's family, the way they do it is uh, you leave them overnight, on, like on the counter, and then first thing in the morning you put them in the fridge. And I believe it takes about two weeks. Uh, before you can eat them uh, But that may vary, but I would say probably two weeks to a month so you can go ahead till they're fully pickled anyway So oh I've got my thing in the vinegar awesome Usually my wife does this kind of stuff. It's kind of nice to mix it up and do something different Yeah, that lid is hot mm -hmm. And I guess these aren't pressure canned, They're, we're just sealing these, so I don't know that they would, so you would have to like actual pressure can them if you wanted to keep them outside the fridge. So these, You would need a different brine as well. Yeah, and, and, and a different brine. This is a completely different recipe. Uh, this is just for refrigerator pickles. And uh, we'll put the recipe at the bottom in the comments. Uh, it's not a secret family recipe or anything. Is it? Okay, <laughs> maybe, maybe it is. Not a secret anymore. <laughs> so... But um, starting to get to that time of year where our pickles, our cucumbers starting to die out. And so uh, we gave a lot of pickles away this year and uh, we're trying to keep some for ourselves as well. I don't eat as many pickles as you do probably, but I like them. We grew uh, four different kinds this year and really the only ones that did that well were the uh, Boston pickling and then the regular like green slicers. We, we tried a couple other ones but uh, this didn't do very well. And uh, there's the final products. We got six jars. How many cucumbers do you think that was? Like 12. 12, 12 cucumbers. I mean, decent sized Boston pickling. And uh, I think we had a couple of lemon, the lemon cucumbers, a couple of those. Lemon cucumbers didn't do very well. It was so hot. I think the heat really has a factor in your cucumbers when it comes to like uh, those crazy breeds like the dragon. We had like the dragon cucumber and then we had a white wonder only only ones that didn't any well even the, the boothby's bond didn't do that well this year so but we know every year we're going to at least at least plant the boston pickling in the slicing because we'll get cucumbers every year so are shorts holding up shorts are holding up great still full as a cucumber uh they are they're, they're holding up they got a hole right here <laughs> but good to go hey guys if you like this video please like, subscribe, and share on your Facebook, YouTube, Instagram page. And uh, we'll see y'all next time. Woo!